guys, it's Allison. Happy Saturday. Um, first of all, someone's going to be asking me, Allison, why do you look like a scrub today? Why do you look like the TLC song Scrubs was probably written about you? Um, a, I'm tired. I've been studying a lot lately. Um, it is the middle of our term. We just had midterms. I'm so tired. I really didn't want to put makeup on. Um, if you watched that last video I put up, I'm still um, trying to take care of my mom. So today we're doing laundry, we're cleaning the house, we have to grocery shop. So I really didn't want to put on a face of makeup to make a video for five minutes. I mean, look, I got a little bleach stain right there. I'm in like my scrub shirt. Um, my hair is a mess, if anybody cares. So I mean, if it pleases you, I'll take it down. We'll make it worse. Let's make this worse. There we go. Yes. So um, this week is tag week, which I'm pretty excited about because I love doing tags on my regular channel. So I was excited to do them here. So this week was kind of like a what's in your purse week. Um, so we've had people do what's in your purse, what's in your school bag, what's in your school tote. So I was like, well, my school bag isn't too exciting. I have a stethoscope, blood pressure cuff, and textbooks like this thick. Um, my purse has a wallet, my phone, some chapstick, and it's just a tote bag I got from Old Navy. So it wasn't exciting. But what is exciting is my camera bag. Um, for those of you that don't know, I do freelance photography on the side, outside of being a student and whatnot. Um, I'll link below down to my photography page if you want to see some of the stuff I've done before. Um, but this bag has a lot in it. Um, so yeah, it's kind of exciting. Um, the bag itself is Modella. It's definitely a makeup bag that I use as a camera bag because I decided that camera bags are pretty not cute. So I got this. So I'll show you what's inside. So in the first kind of the big compartment, I will show you the master of the show, and that is my camera. It is a Nikon D50. It is my pride and joy. I love it so much. Um, it's a great camera. If, you've, if you're into digital SLRs, I highly recommend starting off with at least a D40 or D50 because they're great to start off with. Um, the lens that I have on here, in case anybody actually cares, um, is a... Nikon DX AFS Nikkor 1855mm. So if you can read what it says right there, if my camera focuses. No, it's not in the mood to focus today. It wants to be a scrub like me today. Hey, whatever. Um, so yeah, so that's the actual camera itself with um, one of my lenses that I have. Love my camera, love it so, so much. So yeah, so that's that. Next I have Another one of my lenses, and this is a Opteca lens. Um, and this is like two lenses in one. Let me get it out of its little baggie. This is a fisheye lens and a macro lens. So if you just let me separate it, if you screw off this part and just use this on your camera, this is a macro lens. Look at that. Let's do a little lens effect there. Whoa! Let's do the other side. Someone's gonna be like, this is really annoying, Allison. Don't do it. I looked really creepy right there. I look like a zombie. Oh, I look like a zombie in general. Let's just pretend it's Halloween. I'm a zombie. And then when you put this part back on, it is a fish eye lens. And it also um, doubles as a wide angle lens. Because when you have, if you've never seen fish eye, I wonder if it will do fish eye. There we go. Oh, why don't we start doing that, Allison? That's pretty cool. So this is what like fish eye lo looks like. And then if you kind of like take it, basically when the camera zooms, it turns into wide angle. So it's pretty cool. I love it. Um, this I believe was like $50 on Amazon. It was a really good buy. Um, it's kind of, it's not as practical as it is just kind of cool. Um, Cause it's kind of hard to get it on and off. So I have that. Then I don't know why I have this. Oh, I know why I did a wedding two, three, this is terrible, two, three weeks ago, and um, I had earrings on, and I had these earrings right here, if you can see those, and I got tired because they're so dangly, I couldn't get anything accomplished, so I threw them in here, so that's that. Um, then I have my flash, this is 
If you follow me on Facebook, you notice that I was bitching about how much my flash cost, and then someone wrote, well, my flash costs $800. I don't give a shit. My flash is $80, and I thought it was expensive. So what? Um, it's a ProMaster 25 EDF digital. Um, so it's not too fancy. It just has like on and off features, but it's a great little flash. So if you're looking for a cheap flash, cheap and by other people's standards, I guess, um, this is a really good one. It just pops right onto the front of your camera and there's actually a lock button so it stays in place. And I like that it's not too big. So when I'm shooting, I have a, I have a cap on. It's just not too big. It also, maybe it'll blind someone real quick. Let's do that. Let me show you how bright this is. My cap doesn't want to come off today, guys. Sorry. So yeah, I'll show you how bright it is. Do, 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 do. Someone's gonna be like, uh, why did you do that? And I'm gonna say, because I wanted to. Oh, it's not gonna flash. Man, that's kind of depressing. I really wanted it to flash. Man. It's too, oh, let's turn the light off. There we go. It is not, it's bright in here. You need to flash, sir. Oh, that's why. Duh, guys, because I didn't charge my flash battery. So you would see what it was like, but I'm not smart and I didn't charge it. So that is that. Um, oh, and I don't have a fancy strap. I have an Nikon strap. Um, I had a really cool, like, pink tribal looking one in high school, but I've lost it since then. So yeah, I have cough drops in here too. Cough drops. I have my um, remote, my shutter release remote. So, um, like if I've also, um, my tripod's usually in my bag, but my tripod is what I use to set my camera on. So if I'm doing shots, and I have the camera on the tripod and I either need to be in them or it needs to be far away or something like that. I have this little fancy schmancy remote. So let me show you. So like, basically, is it out of batteries too? Everything is out of batteries this week. Man, this is a bad video. Don't even watch this guys. Just turn your heads. This is out of batteries too. I'm glad I made this video because now I know that all my stuff is out of batteries. So that's good to know. But yeah, this is just a little um, remote shutter button. So that's pretty cool. And I have an extra battery which came with my camera. Um, it's just kind of like an off-brand battery. And then I make sure I don't have anything else. I don't have anything else. And then in my little front pocket, which is this little pocket, are things that I actually take with me. Um, I have an EOS lip balm in case my lips get chopped while I'm doing it, which happened last time because it was really hot. Um, I have a Nivea cream, which I think I'm like out of, yeah, I'm like super out of that now. Um, because my hands, it was really hot the last shoot I did. Your hands get really dry or sometimes they get really like clammy from holding the camera so long. So I keep this to kind of combat that. And then I have a little sample of Britney Spears Fantasy because first of all, I probably should have deodorant in here too. You get really hot, especially if you're working outside. So you need that in there. Um, I also have a Sharpie marker, um, which is really random. I just keep it in there because you never know when you're gonna need a Sharpie marker. And yeah, and that's everything I have in there except for my tripod, which I guess I'll show you my tripod. Hold on, guys. You're going for a ride because I'm unscrewing this. Worst video ever, guys. I probably turned the camera up. So yeah, that's my tripod. I'm in my I'm in the bathroom and the and the oh, and you're upside down, guys. Sorry, yeah, that's my tripod. Um, so yeah, ignore the hideous bathroom. This is the bathroom that, this is the house that we're moving into, so none of it's done, so it's really ugly. So yeah, so thanks for watching Zombie Allison Week, and I will see you next week with a full face of makeup and not looking like a zombie. So as always, guys, thanks for watching. Please subscribe to us. We all love you. Bye!